Yo, what to do, GG Nation, GG Legion. It's your fella again, Strauss, man, the GG. Welcome to another video. Hey, I've been talking about it for a while on stream all last week. You know, we almost had a hurricane. Luckily, we didn't. My heart goes out to everybody that, even though it is empty, goes out to everybody that was affected. Bahamas got killed. North South Carolina, hopefully everybody's okay. We really lucked out here in Florida. But hey, I've been talking about this, but it's finally here. Oh, I almost threw it. <laughs> it is finally here. Catherine, full, fu full body, collector's edition unboxing. But hey, I figured we would do an old versus new. Because I have my original Catherine Collector's Edition from my 360 days. If you guys know the joke, you know, blondes have more fun. You know, I say it all the time on stream and on podcasts and everything here on the channel. You guys know how I like the blonde waifu and Catherine of the Sea. Not Catherine with a K. Like here, pictured here. Um, but this was the only one I was able back in the day, you know, many, many years ago when I was a younger fella. I was able to nab the 360 one. I wasn't able to get the, the PS3 version. But otherwise, that's I would have had the PS3 version. And as you can see, all right, well, it comes in a bunch of comes with a bunch of goodies, pizza box and everything. So I figured I'd show you the old one with the new one as I unbox the full body version. So why not? Why not do that? So let's go. You get the stray sheep pizza box, which is pretty damn cool. If I don't say so myself, that's where Vincent and the gang hang out in the bar, get drunk before you go into a hellish nightmare, you know? So let's dive in. You can see the shirt. I'm already wearing the shirt. This is the same exact shirt that came in this box. But to be honest to God with you guys, I think this is the only time I ever wore it was for this video. So hopefully you enjoy. I apologize for the lighting. I'll tr I'm trying to work on it to make it look a lot better. I know like there's shadows and stuff, but just bear with me. Here is uh, Vincent's famous underwear that he is uh, in his nightmares with. I have not actually wore these, or do I intend not to? I, I do not intend to wear these at all. Uh, the game, of course, which I don't have in the box. It's back here somewhere in my 360 pile. I ain't going to dig it out. But it came with its own soundtrack and art, art book as well. Real, a mini art book. I'm interested to see the art book in this newer one. Here's the uh, here's the greatest woman on earth, Catherine with a C. The best waifu of all waifus. That's the soundtrack. Here's the two covers of the original game. As you see, I have Catherine with a K right here. And then there's Catherine with a C, which is the one you should always choose. Blondes just have more fun. I had to say it again. Here's the cover to look. Uh, I do apologize. I don't want this to be a super long video, but I just... Well, I figured it'd be fun just to show that off. And of course, of course, that beautiful, beautiful be uh, pillowcase. <laughs> Sorry, I can't speak today. Pillowcase of Catherine. Hopefully you guys can get a good look at it. I'm sorry, I can't. I'm trying to see, but I'm like covering the whole screen because it's so big. But hey... I thought that would be fun. Go down memory's lane. But let's get what you came for. What you guys came to watch, obviously, is the actual full body. I am so sorry. I'm, like, speaking way too fast. I'm just so excited to play this. I know it's Borderlands 3 tonight plus NHL 20. Um, so we're going to play, you know, Borderlands 3 at midnight on the channel. Live stream. But I think I might do a live stream of this. Get this started. We'll do a full playthrough of Catherine Full Body because it's not that long of a game. And uh, shout out to my buddy, uh, Jake. I was watching him stream it last week, and he was like, man, this really sounds like a Persona game music-wise. He was listening to all the music and the character looks, and I'm like, yeah, it's made by the same guys that did Persona. It's actually Persona Studio, or Studio Zero, which I think they're called now, um, that has made this. But let's open this up. I'm excited to see. It comes with a steel book. I'm trying not to. Oh, you know what? It's like the OG one. You just whoop. All right. Trying not to. Oh, 
Did not want to mess that up, but here, open some sheepies for you. That's how you view everybody in the other world. So what's the difference, right? Well, full body, right? What's the difference? Let me tell you about that really quick. They added a new waifu, Rin in the middle here. Oops, sorry, pink hair. Pink hair, Rin right here. Sorry, I'm not pointing, right? Pink hair, <laughs> Rin right here. Pink hair, Rin. And it completely changes the game. Not only do you have to choose between... The premise of the game is your middle-aged man, Vincent, like 33 years old. Catherine with a K, your girlfriend for a long time, is pressuring you for marriage. But Catherine with a C, young, busty, 20-year-old something, bust into your life. And you got to choose in between the two. But now there's a third girl with Catherine with a Q, which is what they say. So we'll see how that goes. I'm going to do, like I said, a full playthrough, but I'm probably choosing Catherine with a C again. It's been so long since I played this game. Let's hop in. All right. So the first thing we get, as you can see, the box is the tower. The tower of hell that you don't ever want to be in for your nightmares. But you get a little sheepy plush. Little Jeffrey the sheep here. No, I think this is Vincent because of the underwear scheme, but it is a Vincent plush. Dude, uh, dudes, I'm so excited to play this. This game is so fun. You guys know how much I gush about Persona and everything, and I just, this game, I'm glad to see it get a second chance of life. Added content. And actually, it wasn't censored. I know a lot of people were really concerned. It, It's very, you know, non censored at all like there's i think there's only one thing with a dead name i don't want to spoil it because it's a big part of the game it's a big spoiler of the game and here's the new lovable waifu ren the new catherine sheepies on the box here's it's interesting to see how different the art books are it looks like this uh oh well we got some more i'm not going to show you every single page but i'll show you a couple. Here's Vincent, the main the main fella you're playing as. Voiced by Troy Baker himself. I don't know if they all came back to reprise the roles. I'm assuming they did. Assuming they did. Some sketch, you know, sketches of him. I'm so excited to di uh, dig in. Here's lovely Ren. I don't want to spoil anything. Hopefully there's no spoilers in here. Okay, good, good, good. Obviously, the Beth Catherine, you guys got to choose. Blondes have more fun. Again, I apologize if this video goes a little long. It's just, I just love this game so much. And uh, you guys can see how fast I'm, like, going. And I just need to enjoy. Let's just enjoy this moment. And then there's, obviously, lovable, mature Catherine with a K. Um, interesting note, Catherine with a, a, a K is voiced by Yukari's voice actress in Persona 3. And Laura Bailey does Catherine with a C, blonde Catherine, who she voices Risei in Persona 4. So it's really interesting that both the lover arcanas are the voice actresses of the game. Let's see. I don't want to spoil anything else. Okay, there's a little bit of... Yeah, okay, we'll, we'll leave that out. We'll leave that out. I don't want to spoil... Because we're going to play it together. Here's the soundtrack. Catherine, full body. 21... 21 tracks. Very awesome. Not going to open it yet. Let's save that. I like to keep those sealed for now. And yes, the steel book. I'm excited to look at this. And I'll open it completely. Just make sure there's no DLC code or anything. All right, we're okay. We're good. Let me show you the disc. I believe this doesn't. It's unfortunate. It's the deluxe version of the game, but doesn't come with the, the DLC, which is kind of a bummer. Here you go, the Sheepies. And I really like this Steelbook, man. The Steelbook is really nice. I like this a lot. I can't wait to dive in. We're probably going to... I'm going to try to stream. I forgot there's a football game. It's Thursday Night Football tonight. I'm probably going to stream a little bit of this before Borderlands 3 tonight. If not, I'll just see. I'll catch you guys for Borderlands 3. I am super excited 
to dive in. We'll do a full playthrough of this game. I'll do it by episodes. Short streams, hour, hour and a half. We'll just... Because this game's not super long. Probably like... 8 to 10 hours, I would say. I know they added some new stuff, so... not written, Written's not the only thing they added. I do apologize. Um, they added some multiplayer features uh, to the game as well, so we could play together. That'd be fun. That'd be a fun stream to play against you guys. Uh, they added... Um, ugh, new endings for both Catherines. There's new endings for both of them. So there's newer endings to strive for, so you don't have the same endings. You do have all the same endings, but they have two extra ones, one for each... Uh, Catherine, and plus Rin has a slew of endings. I think she has like three or four. So I'm interested to dive in and play. We'll probably do a, a Rin playthrough eventually. Uh, something seems up with her. There's something up. There's something you can't trust this base. Maybe neither of these, but I, I'm i gonna probably, you guys know the Bearded Wonder Chad is supposed to keep me in check on stream and waifu Catherine with a Q. Well, I'm probably going Catherine with a C again. <laughs> I just, well, I saw her again. When I played the demo, I saw her again. I was just like, yeah, 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 yeah. Um, so I'm interested to dive in. All the goodies. You get an art book. You get a soundtrack. Steel book. With game. And a Vincent, Vincent Sheep plushie there. Catherine, full body, premium deluxe. I know you've probably seen a lot. I'm pretty late on this, but mine finally came in. So, again, kind of. I think it got lo uh, lost in the hurricane a little bit or it got canceled. Or I ordered it later. Than I expected, but hey, it finally arrived. I'm excited to dive in again. We'll do a full playthrough Borderlands 3 tonight. Uh, so if I don't see you for Catherine tonight, uh, we'll just go right into Borderlands 3 tonight. I'm excited to start that. I'll start that here on the YouTubes. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe. I am Straussman the GG. We do a lot of podcasts on here, reaction videos. I saw the Death Stranding gameplay yesterday, late last night. So we'll we'll do some re we got some more reactions coming up, but it's gonna be a busy day for the channel. But stay tuned, live stream coming up. Follow that link down below as well for Twitch because we're so close on Twitch. But I'll be live streaming on here on YouTube tonight. But we're so close to the sub button on Twitch. Tell me your memories. Do you did you ha did you play the original Catherine, or did you, or, or did you just excited to dive in full body? I know a lot of you uh, Persona fans are diving in for the first time because you didn't realize it's made by the Persona team, but hey, you know, a lot of us were really excited when Catherine originally came out because we are like, oh, okay, maybe Persona will have some older adults this time because they like the setting so much. We love the setting so much of Catherine with adults that, you know, we didn't maybe we didn't want to play as high school kids, but obviously that didn't happen. Persona 5 was my game year for 2017. Well, we got a lot of podcasts, a lot of things coming up to the channels. Just stay tuned. Your fellow Strassman, the GG, I'm outie.